with the loss of her dog. But she's comforted knowing the tragedy may have saved many other lives. Contact 13 investigative reporter Stephanie Zeppelin has a story. Fishing and spending time with her dogs are two of Mary Jo Davis's hobbies. Just more than two weeks ago, she was out on Penguich Lake with Midge and Max when she saw a man kayaking. He paddled over to the other side of the lake and uh, next thing I know, the kayak flipped him and he started yelling for help. Mary Jo managed to pull him from the water. In the ruckus of getting him on board, my dogs were barking and carrying on. Somehow I lost track of Midge. Don't know how she managed to go overboard, but she did. Midge, her Maltese Yorkie mix, was missing. She says everyone in the area rallied around her and helped look for Midge. And I walked up and talked to a woman standing on the shore looking out, um, asked her if she'd seen my dog, and I said I lost her when I fished the kayaker out of the lake a few minutes ago, and she said, Oh, I'm so glad you did. That was my husband. Thank you so much. And she gave me the biggest hug. Her husband, the kayaker Mary Jo saved, also happens to be a Metropolitan Police officer. She asked us not to reveal his identity because they're both worried he may get in trouble. Neither the kayaker nor Mary Jo's dog were wearing a life vest. And while Mary Jo's heart is breaking, she's looking at the bigger picture of what happened out on the lake with that police officer. He's going to be out there helping someone else out and saving lives and making a difference in the world. So that's, that's really awesome. Stephanie Zeppelin, 13 Action News. New at 6, the man accused of